generally in life, do you have a choice? Well, I'm not that sure. Let's make it simple. Do you choose what you eat? Yes. Do you have the choice where to sleep? Yeah. Do you choose to go to school? Well, I do. At times, do you have the choice to spend your money without thinking of tomorrow? Yes. I guess I do have a choice in my life. Lucky for you, but unfortunately for the poor, they are put to a reality where most of the time, they do not have a choice. They are stuck in a cycle where once they are born in poverty, it will likely pass to their children. And most often, the increasing poverty rate is blamed to them, the poor and marginalized, claiming that they could have made better choices. But the question is, did they choose to be poor? Do they even have a choice? In 2018, PSA reported that 16.6% of the population of the Philippines are poor, meaning their income is not enough to meet their basic food. Not enough to have a safe place to live. And not enough to afford their education. This is the harsh truth faced by the poor. But there is hope. Fortunately for some of us, we are at advantage. We are privileged to have a life made out of our choices. So use your voice for the better. Choose to help the marginalized. Manifest your authentic self to extend help to those people who need it. Demand for the better laws that will give the poor an opportunity to live. Fight for human rights. Join and participate in organizations and propose micro-solutions. Although these are small steps, it may be a tool to a transformational change. And finally, strengthen the country's democracy by amplifying the voice of the poor. Together, you and I. Let's build a nation where everyone has the choice and the opportunity to a better life. Cause we're in this together now. You and me together now What's the point?